Hello there, Robbie Guy here, and today we're gonna be opening up this RC is a V-Star Premium Collection Box. I'm super excited to be opening this up. Um, we got this from GameStop, which had the great deals for Black Friday, where if you bought one of these, you got a $25 gift card, and right now, I believe at GameStop, you could even get an additional 25% off, and then use that gift card, and if you're uh, a member for GameStop, you get the $5 off, you could really rack up some savings if you're trying to get your hands on one of these boxes, so uh, go down there, check it out, and uh, let's jump into this box and see how we do. Let's go. Alrighty, I deconstructed the box already, but I just wanted to show off how beautiful this box is, and like the attention to the detail Pokemon is really putting into their product. We have the mat here, which is super cool. We get the, you know, basic V-Star token. You get the metal coin, which is cool. Some metal dice. I'm just gonna move that stuff out of the way here. But the real star of the show, in my opinion, are these RCSV and V-Star promos that are metal, which is absolutely stunning the way it shines and everything. The feel of the card, it's nice and heavy. It looks a little off-colored from your standard card, but very cool um, to see from a premium collection box. And we have quite the variety of packs today. We got some Lost Origin, Astral Radiance, Brilliant Stars, Vivid Voltage, some more Lost Origin. I'm just gonna sort this so I could go by order. Oh, and Evolving Skies. So we're gonna go like this. Yep, yep. That, that checks out with me. I hope you guys are okay with that order. Um, <laughs> we'll go into our first Vivid Voltage pack. Um, 15 packs in this pack opening. It is going to be a long video, so um, get yourself comfortable. Get ready to relax and enjoy some packs being cracked. Um, we got ourselves a Dark Energy, a Crocorock, a Romatic Energy, Swellow, Wismer, Execute, Woobat, Beldum, Blitzel, a rock wrap going into a Metagross for the rare. Um, fun way to start the pack opening. Having such a variety of packs, um, a large volume of packs as well. This box, like I said earlier in the intro, um, goes for a little over $100, I think, typically. But the way they're doing it with, uh, you know, the, the, the sales they have, um, I think Black Friday, you were able to get a gift card with it, which was a huge deal. Um, there's a lot of ways you could knock the price down on this. And just being a member at GameStop, you automatically get like $5 off, which is huge. This Altaria is a pretty nice uh, reverse hollow to get. Um, I've seen people do some interesting things with that Altaria with their decks. So, um, very cool. Um, no hollow rares yet. But with 15 packs, I'm not too worried. I think we're going to get lucky. One of these packs is going to have something, and everything's going to be okay. So we got that Lightning Energy, Rescue Carrier, Boost Shake, Verbombi, Eevee, Cutie Fly, Pikachu, Applin, Lillipup, Avalog, going into that Rayquaza VMAX. I really wish this was the other one, but that's all right. <laughs> Still a stunning card indeed. Um, we'll get a sleeve on that. We'll put you up with the... RC is a V and V star over there. Um, we'll keep it moving. We'll go into our next Brilliant Stars pack. Um, Brilliant Stars has just been such a fun set. Um, chances of pulling a Charizard, um, character gallery cards. They're really trying to give you um, all these options for cards you could chase down and collect. And that's what keeps Pokemon interesting to me. It's just like the possibilities of what you can pull from a pack. This was very water heavy. Sir Twig Starly. Spirit Tomb, Purloin, Sock, into Star Raptor. Um, I didn't even save the reverse for the other pack, but that's okay. The Rayquaza is still the show. Um, we'll jump into our next pack here. Just falling apart. Not a big deal. Code card. Enjoy. Let's see how we do. We got that Metal Energy, Claydol, Executor, Weavile, Sock, Corpfish, Golet, Chimchow, Chimchar, Clink, going into a Lapras for the rare. I'm still no hollow rare. That's usually like how I measure how packs are going. So, um, I mean, we did pull a VMAX. Can't really complain there. But we are going into our next pack here. Hopefully we get lucky. 
I would love to see some pulls from Brilliant Stars. Brilliant Stars is just uh, a set that's been very elusive for me. We have that Water Energy, a Sigalith, Pachirisu, Choice Belt, Impidimp, Staryu, Friolu, Starly, Milseri, a Mewtwo. According to the a rainbow secret rare um absolutely stunning um definitely a fun box <laughs> we'll just put a sleeve on it just to keep it pretty and we will put you down there um with that Rayquaza v max um <laughs> such a cool card um and we still got one more brilliant stars pack so any anything's possible um code card enjoy Let's see how we do. We got that Metal Energy, Magma Basin, Crawdont, Claydol, Sneasel, Clink, Spiritomb, Axew, Impidimp, a Golet going into a Lipard, which was a very uh, playable card from Brilliant Stars. It was actually one of the cards they gave away in the Build and Battle decks. I'm sure I've said that countless times when I ever see that card, because that's the only thing I think of when I see it. Um, we're going to jump into Astral Radiance, which... Um, in my opinion, is one of my favorite sets um, from the Sword and Shield era. Introduction, the introduction to Hisui and Pokemon in the TCG. Um, I really enjoyed playing in the Hisui region. Just um, a fantastic game, in my opinion. Uh, Psyduck, Drifloon, Sudowoodo, Magnemite, Azelf going into that Magna Zone, which was also in one of those build and battle boxes. Um, we'll go to the next Astral Radiance pack here. Um, the character gallery cards from Astral Radiance were also amazing. Um, there's, like, any of the character gallery cards I'm a huge fan of. I honestly would prefer them over most uh, Rainbow Rares, in my opinion. Um, that's just me, though. Uh, Hissuian Overquill, Jubilife Village, Noctowl, Routes, Sneasel, Mistrivus, Farboach, Ponyard, Seeing Basculin going into that cleaver, which uh, this pack had a lot of the Hisuian Pokemon that we love to see. Uh, I don't, I don't really know which Hisuian Pokemon is my favorite. Um, I did use a lot of Overquill when I played Legends Arceus and uh, Cleaver too. It, it, I think it really just depends. I mean, like my favorite Hisuian starter is gonna be Typhlosion. I'm sorry. Um, i just not a big fan of Samurott. Um, the Sidui was cool, but I think the Grass Ghost typing was better, in my opinion. That's just me, but, um, Barboach, Scyther, Miltank, going into the Hisuian Samurott V. Um, that's the alternate art as well. <coughs> Sorry for coughing on camera, but I'm working through some things. So where do I keep my sleeves? Let's see. Do I got sleeves over here? Am I just out of sleeves? My goodness gracious. I got sleeves. There we go. Lovely. Boop. Nice. And we get to add that to our collection over here with that Rayquaza VMAX and that Shaman V-Star. We still got a couple packs left. That's like the amazing thing about opening this box is it never ends. Or at least that's how it feels to me at least. Um, I would love to get some more pulls. Um, our last Astral Radiance pack, I would really love to see a character gallery card um, out of these next coming uh, packs we open. Because the possibility is there. It's been there since Brilliant Stars, since I started opening those. But, you know, you, you only get as lucky as the packs will let you be, right? So we have a Mistrevis, a Barboach, Scyther, Vespaquin, going into the Hisuian Overquill. Um, I believe the Hisuian Overquill had two different artworks in the set which was pretty cool. Um, Lost Origin. Um, I feel like I've opened a lot of Lost Origin packs, but at the same time, I feel like I haven't pulled anything from Lost Origin, if that makes sense. So uh, hopefully that our luck changes today because we got four packs to go through. Um, not a bad suction. We have the Grass Energy, Lake Acuity, Nuzleaf, Carbink, Phantom, Makuhira, Electric, Murkrow, Shuppet, Volo, and a Raichu. Very cool. And we got three more packs to go. Hopefully we get lucky. Hopefully I can get some pulls here. Keep this moving. 
code card. Enjoy. As you guys know, I always give away the code cards on the channel. And uh, if you want a chance to get some code cards for yourself, please hit that subscribe button. And we have that Dark Energy Aluminion, Mirage Gate, Amachoke, Rock Rough, Seal, Hisuian Zora, very, very cool Hisuian Pokemon, Machop, Riley, going into that Orbeetle um, with jamming attachment for an ability. Very cool. Um, two packs left. Man, hopefully we get lucky. I really don't want to end this on just like three pulls for 15 packs. To me, that doesn't seem worth it. Hopefully, we just get lucky. Um, code card, enjoy. There's going to be a lot of code cards from this box. Um, Dark Energy, Lost City, Carbink, Komala, Paris, Inke, Suing Basculin, Jinx, Makuhedia, Phantom. Going into that air deck will be... We're so close to pulling the like alternate art for this i love aerodactyl as one of the fossil pokemon so like anytime there's like an aerodactyl card i get excited so we'll add that to our collection here and we're going to come down to the last pack here hopefully we get some last pack magic um let's just see how we do hopefully we get lucky that'd be sweet i don't think so with the white code card on the back but you never know we could get the character gallery card still or Anything that comes in that uncommon slot. So we got that um, Water Energy, Lost Vacuum, Cascoon, Lampant, Horsey, Meditite, Shellos, Mianfu, Litleo, Magarina, and a Dugong for the rare. Um, I just want to say thank you guys for watching today's video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. A lot of packs were cracked. We went from Vivid Voltage like all the way up to Lost Origin which is super fun. A bunch of code cards were given out today. A lot of pulls. We had that Aerodactyl V, the Hisuian Samurott, which I was kind of bashing on a little bit, and that's why we pulled it. Um, that Shaman V-Star, Rainbow Rare, and that Rayquaza V-Max from Evolving Skies. So um, I'm sure there's been better boxes of this being opened, but uh, this was our box. So thanks for watching. Please hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't and comment down below and let me know what your favorite card was from today's video and we'll see you guys next time. Thanks. Bye.